Would you like to know an easy way to attack the Sicilian defense with e4 c5? Well, then I have just the system to suggest for you. If I play knight to c3, and after knight to c6, play a system known as the Grand Prix attack with f4. So named after the Grand Prix chess tournaments, not Formula 1 racing, but Grand Prix chess, where these players are using this very nice attacking system to win a lot of games. It was playing bishop to c4, so the bishop you can see is playing a lot of pressure on this pawn here. Of course, black can play a lot of different moves, but I'm just showing you what white's basic idea is if black were to play the usual dragon set that one typically sees in the anti Sicilians. So castles are now, it's very important to remember this next move for white. Well done if you found this idea of playing queen to e1. So why the queen move? Well, the queen is not going to stay on e1, right? But instead, after black plays the moves, we'll play queen h4, and of course, it's not the best way for black to play, but just to demonstrate white's idea, we're going to sacrifice a pawn for the attack with f5. So if black takes, we play the bishop to h6, and one really funny line is that if they keep taking the pawns, we don't take back, but we just go knight g5, and you see that, well, the black king is coming under a massive attack, and that after moves like bishop takes g7, that we can crash through in a very nice way with a move like rook takes f6. So if e takes f6, then we see queen h7 as a checkmate. 